Alan Solosh here, the Passive Income Guru, and this video tutorial explains to you how to connect MT4 to FPS on the VPN. Right, so the first step that you need to do is you need to log into your VPN. So please pause the video, go and log into your VPN now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. Now that you've logged into the VPN, uh, you should be looking at uh, this screen over here with this little window that's open. And what you need to do is you can just cancel this little uh, window, close this little window by he either hitting the X or you can say cancel. So uh, please pause the video, go and do that step now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. Now if that window wasn't there, don't worry. Uh, then uh, what will what you need to do is is just uh, either this window will be here or there won't be a window at all. Right. So if there are no windows showing, no login window showing, just scroll down to the bottom right hand corner of the account where it either says invalid account or no connection, and then you can just click on that and uh, click on the in, that uh, the, the words in red, and then click on log in, and you'll see that the login details appear in the top left hand corner of your screen. So if there's no login detail shown, please pause the video. Please go and do that step now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. So what is happening now is um, uh, MT4 is the platform that all retail Forex traders use to trade Forex. And uh, we now need to connect this platform to the FBS account that you created, the sent account that you created. Make sure that you did create the sent account. If you didn't create the sent account, please go back to video one uh, to find out how to create a sent account. So it's asking you for your credentials that you got from um, from uh, FBS and they were emailed to you uh, if you did not save them. So let's go and find that email uh, right now. So please pause the video, go and find that email now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. Right, so this is the email that I received from FBS and it's got there my, this is a demo. So I've just created a demo sent account for the purpose of this video. You will have a totally uh, different uh, um, email to what I've got with regards to the server. It'll your server will say real uh, one to ten or or something like that. Uh, but don't don't worry about it. Now, if for some reason you can't find the email from FPS, don't worry. Just log into your FPS platform now. So please pause the video. Go and log into the FPS.com platform now into your account. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. Now you'll be on your real section. I'm on my demo section over here. Uh, and then there'll probably only be one account here, which will be, it'll say their sent account. And then what you can do is you can just click on uh, the account number. So please pause the video, go and click on your account number now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. The next step is to create a new password. So you can just click on create new and then and then uh, generate password. So please pause the video, go and do those two steps now. Once done, you can come back to the video and resume the video. Now you can see here are your here is your login information as per uh, the email that you should have received. So let me continue uh, with my email uh, that I received from FPS. So here are the um, here is the uh, the login user number, okay, which you need to copy. So copy that number now, and then go back to the VPN and paste that number into this area where it says login details. So please pause the video, go and do that step now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. Now what you do is is that you need to enter the password that was given to you. By FPS. Now, if you didn't save that password, you can just click on the view button, and what will happen is is that a new browser will open, and your um, your password will then appear over here. Okay, uh, so copy that password and then go back to the VPN and then paste it into the area where it says password. So please pause the video, go and do that step now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. The next step is to uh, choose the uh, server um, that is in, that is on, that FPS is allocated to you. So either go back to your, um, your email 
or on the um, on the website um, where you've just gotten your password, it'll say there what the server is. And whatever server is in this field over here will be the server that you choose on the VPN. So if your server says in your email or on the website says server real one, then you choose real one. If it says real seven, then you choose real seven. As I explained to you, I'm using a demo account just for the purpose of this video. So I'm going to choose FPS demo and then you can click on the login detail, uh, the login button. So please pause the video, go and do that step now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. Now, after you've logged in, you must make sure that there are numbers um, uh, changing in the, in the bottom right-hand corner, and those numbers indicate that um, you have connected successfully to FPS, and um, uh, the, uh, the currencies are now being transmitted to your platform. Uh, that we've just connected to. Now that you've connected your account, there's a couple of things that we need to do so as to make this a little bit easier uh, for you to see what's going on on the screen. So what you what you do is is that you just with your mouse go over the blue bar, left mouse click down, and then drag the window um, somewhere into uh, the, the the FPS or the MT4 Trader window. Just drag it so that you can see the black screen. Just drag it about about to there, about a quarter way uh, or halfway into the screen and let go your mouse button and the window will then remain. Now what you need to do, so please pause the video, go and do that step now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. The next thing that you need to do is hover your mouse over the top left corner of MetaTrader 4 and you'll see that you'll get a diagonal line with two arrows. What you need to do is you need to left mouse click down and then w just drag the window down into the bottom left hand corner and then let go the mouse. So please pause the video, go and do that step now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. The next thing you can do is, is that you can left click mouse down on the blue bar and then drag the video, uh, drag MT4 back into, um, into the top left hand corner of MT4, of, of, oh, sorry, of your, of your, uh, of your desktop so please pause the video go and do that step now once done you can come back to this video and resume the video the the, the last uh, the second last step that you need to do is to hover your mouse over the bottom right hand corner of metatrader 4 until you see the diagonal lines with the two arrows left mouse click down and then drag uh, metatrader 4 so that you can now see uh, metatrader 4 clearly in your screen. So please pause the video, go and do that step now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. So as you can see now, you cannot see the charts um, clearly. So what you need to do is you can just click on this four, uh, the four blocked icon uh, and that will reposition your graphs within the MetaTrader 4 um, platform. So please pause the video, go and do that step now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. The last thing that you need to do, or the second last thing that you need to do rather, is to close all your charts uh, just by hitting the X button on the charts. Um, so please pause the video, go and do that step now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. Uh, the, the last thing that you need to do is, uh, over here you can see, uh, this is where the, the currencies are that you're going to be trading. You can't really see what's going on, so you need to mouse over uh, this little pane on uh, within uh, the market watch uh, where the symbols are until you get your diagonal line with the two arrows left mouse click down and then drag the window to the right and now you'll be able to see the currency so please pause the video go and do that step now once done you can come back to this video and resume the video uh, then over here just right click anywhere on one of these currencies and then say uh, show all so please pause the video go and do that step now once done you can come back to the video and resume the video the last thing is to click on to trade and you can see there that uh, your account is either showing with uh, a zero balance I hope it has been funded by now you should have gone through that video to fund your account so it should show your balance and there will be two extra digits there because your balance is now showing in cents so in US cents so this is a thousand dollar account so to 
uh, understand um, how to do that is you would just move the decimal two places from right to left to get to the value of your account and as you can see if you move the decimal place uh, two places from right to left on the screen you'll see that it shows there a thousand dollars yours will obviously reflect reflect the amount of money that you transferred onto your um, into your FPS account so now you're ready to trade you're ready to set up the bot congratulations for getting this far uh, go on to uh, the next step I think it's step four and uh, let's get your bot set up so that we can make some massive passive income before you go, uh, if you'd like to earn a little bit of Bitcoin, I give away 0 0.005 of a Bitcoin every single Friday to a random subscriber. Uh, if you'd like to earn that, there's a couple of things that you need to do. You need to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And how you do that is you just mouse over the video that you're watching. And in the bottom right hand corner of the video is a YouTube icon. Click that icon now. So please pause the video. Go and do that step now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. Now, if you're not already logged into your Gmail account, then you'd need to log into your Gmail account. Now, below the video that you're watching on YouTube, there is a subscribe button. So what you do is you click on that subscribe button and then next to the subscribe button is a bell icon. You can click on the bell icon. So please pause the video. Go and do those steps now. Once done, you can come back to this video and resume the video. The next thing that you do is you need to give a thumbs up. And then in the comment section, which is over here, you can leave a positive comment uh, with together with your uh, Bitcoin wallet address. Now, you have to follow the steps exactly to be able to get that prize. So you need to subscribe. You need to hit the bell icon. You need to give a thumbs up and you need to leave a positive comment with your Bitcoin wallet address. Only then are you entered into the competition and are legible to win a prize if chosen. So if you want to win 0 0.005 of a Bitcoin, I highly recommend that you follow those steps and then uh, you'll be eligible to win that prize. So good luck and I hope you win that prize. And if you do, remember to invest it in a passive income stream and I'll see you on the next video. You know that I'm gonna do it, right?